All right, so first time in my life I've ever been worried I was gonna get attacked by a deer when I was trying to get into my house. So there's the deer, front door, deer. I hope I don't get pummeled. Let's see what happens. All right, guys, I'm just passing through. Passing through. You guys are cool. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. There's like a lot of them now. All right. It's deer apocalypse. If nobody hears from me, it's because these guys ate me. This is crazy. All right. I'll leave you guys alone. All right. So I decided I had to just take a break and enjoy this. And I wanted to share this again just because this is so cool um i'm just sitting here chopping wood and i'm always keeping an eye over my shoulder and i didn't see anything i turned back 15 seconds later literally 15 seconds later um i'm just sitting here like i said i'm chopping wood not even six feet away from me are these guys i don't know how many of these guys i've got looking at me But there's a lot of them, and it's bizarre. Um, but it's really cool at the same time, so I can't complain. Um, yeah, this is just neat. That's the one that's not sure about me. He's like, I don't know. I'm cool, I swear. You too, I'm cool. This is my third winter on this property living completely off the grid. In past years, the deer wouldn't come by to scavenge the leftovers from the bird feeder until I'm actually inside the RV. This year it's been pretty different. It's always been an amazing experience to observe wild animals in their own habitat, but to see them this up close and relaxed has been pretty incredible. I always try to keep my distance from any of the animals here, especially the bears. I like to think that we all have an understanding. I don't interfere with you, and they'll typically do the same. This year's been so different though, and I feel pretty lucky to be able to see such beautiful moments like this on an everyday basis. I really hope they don't plan on making a habit out of this though. And that's it for this one. I just wanted to share this real quick because it doesn't seem fair to keep moments like this all to myself. Thank you for watching and I can't wait to share more experiences like this while living off the grid.